All right, so let's go to Fia. We've been having a lot of fun today. We just did... We just released live from the Ever Jail. And now we are going... Oh, I think we're going to Necron. But we're going to go check Fia first and make sure that our quest with her well, isn't messed up or anything. All right, we're going to go do the whole get hugged by Fia. We'll go from there. All right. So what is going on right now with I Pia? I am pleased to see. Would you like now? Come closer. Looks like it's time for a drink. Thanks, girl. You are so very warm. Okay. Talk in secret. I was known as a deathbed companion. Where I come from, after I received the warmth and lively vigor from a number of champions, I lay with the remains of an exalted noble to grant him another chance at life. To do so is the purpose of my being. But before I could bear the noble into new We've life, heard this before, I'm pretty sure. I was awakened by the guidance of grace and chased from my birthplace. Pray, be kind. Despite all that, I still wish to be a deathbed companion. So please, let me hold you like this as often as it takes. Do you know? My dear, have you ever heard of Black Knife Prince? Dear Roger likes to talk of them when abed. Did we not do and this on this guy? plot in which the first of the demigods was slain. The Black Knives wielded by the assassins who committed the act, oh. along with the impressions they made, somehow hide the truth of the conspiracy. These grand affairs are hardly my forte. But dear Roger began to weep as he spoke. About the Black Knife print. In truth, I've heard tell from someone else about the Black Knife prints that fascinate dear Roger so. Okay. But it wouldn't be right to give this to him, stuck as he is in the round table hold. Perhaps you could make use of it? So we just got this. We asked about the Knight of Black Knives and we have gotten the knife print clue. So now we need to get the black knife print in the black knife catacombs. Okay. Now, the thing I'm a little bit concerned about here is I think there's some stuff we might have missed doing it in this order. Let's go find out. This is the issue of running three playthroughs in parallel. <laughs> Always good to see. So. Hmm. Maybe I should tell you. Lately, I feel I'm on the precipice of falling into a deep, fathomless slumber. And I have an inkling it could spell trouble for you somehow. So I just wanted to get the apology out of the way beforehand. Since you're so scary and all. Okay. Oh. Do I have to get maybe? Hold on. Let me try to rest real quick. <sighs> no, not you. <sighs> oh no. <sighs> Wait. I, I think we did it wrong. I think, is it okay? All right, hold on. Uh, can I go? I don't want to keep resting until he dies. Can I still salvage the quest or did we progress too far at this point? 
Um, I like. I wonder if we could go get the black knife print now. You should load to before you talk to him, so it doesn't trigger the three days. Hey, Scarly Potato, thanks, man. Uh, let's do this. I'm gonna Alt F4, and we're not gonna. Let's go get the black. Let's talk to Fia. Let's go get get the black knife print and see if we can like progress that that way, maybe. Oh, wait a second. Oh. I don't think it matters, does it? I don't think it matters. Yeah. If we if we join Ronnie, I mean he's just like that's it. Yep. Okay. Never mind. Okay. What's a cat? Mm -mm -mm. Okay. And we back. Wait. For Rajier sacrificed for Ronnie. Is that what he did? I think I I don't I don't know if he sacrificed for. You think he did? Oh wow. Ooh, there's like flies. Ugh. Alright, we're not gonna talk to him yet. Let's go see if we can get the knife print. Which is right here. That's weird. We killed the boss here. So, um, I'm not sure what that means in terms of finding the item. Because, yeah, I, I definitely remember killing the boss here. Oh, there's going to be another one? All right, so we're looking for um, a hidden wall somewhere through here. Is it down there? Oh no, I think it was here. Wasn't this the hidden wall? Yo. If you do this quest first, does it mess up? Try talking to Fia again? Okay. Because I thought I was supposed to give the black knife print to Rajie. Oh, no. No, it is Rajie. Give black knife print to him. Let's talk to Fia again. You give the knife to D? I don't, dude. I don't have the D, or <laughs> I don't have the knife to give to D. Let's talk to Fia again. <sighs> okay. Mm hmm. Maybe we already gave it to Rajie. Maybe, but then Fia's dialogue was a little would weird. You like now.
YouTube Shorts brought me here? Nice, dude. Hell yeah. Appreciate it. You are so... Oh, by Very the way, shorts well. have started up on the new channel. So if you go to the Stellar Thoughts video, that, that YouTube channel has uh, is getting shorts now. Just a heads up. About Rogier. I heard that you lent a hand to dear Roger. He Roger. seemed positively elated. He must be possessed of great mental fortitude. It you like short shorts? Co like short and shorts. sustains him. Despite his grievous wounds, you truly are a champion. To dear Roger. Roger. And myself, too. Oh. My family just got to the beach safe and sound. Hooray. Awesome. Uh, okay. Sacrificial twig. Thank you for the small piece of wood. My dear, might I ask something of you? Could you please find the owner of this dagger and return it to them? <laughs> Ooh. A certain person gave it to me as a gift. It's a very precious thing. It must have a special place in the owner's heart. So I would like for the original owner to have it back, if you wouldn't mind. About the dagger. I'd like you to find the owner of the dagger I gave you and return it to them. It's a very precious thing. It must have a special place. Then good day to you. Go ahead and pop that. Get that HP back. Uh, okay. Dagger received from Fia the Deathbed Companion. She wishes for it to be returned to its rightful owner. It was once a, once a special weapon of gold and silver intertwined, but is now worn down and marred by a black gash. Gold and silver intertwined. All right, so we are going to give the, the dagger to him and wait, and then Fia will move to Deep Root. Okay, great. And then at that point, I think we're good to go. Am I streaming tomorrow? I absolutely am. Gonna be streaming a lot tomorrow. Yep. Did you need something else? Have this dagger, bro. Well, what have we here? So, am I streaming today? How no. Did you get your hands on that dagger? Well, that hardly matters. I know very well whose dagger it is. Why don't I return it to them for you? Good work bringing this to me. Is that it? Now we rest and she's gone? There you go. No head ahead. Uh, I'm going to check something real quick. Oh, there's a new room. She's in a different room down the hall. Thank you. Okay. I just I just want to check something real quick. Did that hit him? I don't think that hit him. Yeah, I, I just want to see, like, what our current damage is looking like on this guy. Like, if it's the kind of thing where I can actually try this, or if I'm going to use a big hit on him and it's going to do, like, one pixel of let's, let's take a look.
Okay. Um. So, I don't quite know how I'm missing. Seemed a little weird. Seemed very weird. Um. I'm gonna try getting right behind him. But I will say, I will say that I think, like we were, we were when we hit him, we did decent damage. Um, we definitely did decent damage. So I do wonder. Let's let's give it let's give it one try. We'll give it one death. We'll give it one one true death. And I am still gonna try to escape. But I'm gonna I, I with trying to escape. I'm going to see if we can uh, get him. Here we go. So beautiful. God, this guy. This is insane. I love it. Boy, look what they did to my boy, chat. Okay. Um all right. <laughs> okay. Woo! <laughs> that was uh <sighs> okay. Um wow. <sighs> so, let's go update this weapon and have an alternative. Mhm. Mm congrats whoever just beat the game. Nice. Big congrats. Thanks, chat. Appreciate you. Someone in the Gary Coon group just beat the game. You love to see it, chat. You love to see it. I think that gets us like all a souls buff for like 15 minutes or something. <clears throat> okay, so let's take a look. What did we get? I wasn't expecting two weapons. Uh, we got this guy, the Gargoyle's Black Blade. That looks amazing. Um. It does holy damage. And then what is this thing? This is probably dex, isn't it? Is it you? I thought it was a halberd. This. Hey, 
Dang, which one do I use, y'all? What do you guys think? I can, I'm, I'm only have enough to update one of these. What is power stancing? Uh, dual wielding the same type of weapon. Dual wield the great swords? What? What? Mm hmm. <laughs> what? Like, really? Can I? Can, now, this sword that I have deals holy damage. Does does that mean that I can't enchant it with a with a weapon? Enchant? Or can I? I cannot. Ah, no. Do you have anything new with you? Well, you know what this means. The earth tree has. Burned you. The fingers remain still, shaken by this turn of events. They are busy consulting the crater will. When they are finished, the fingers will again offer their guidance. But thousands, if not tens of thousands, of moons must first pass. No matter for me. But you, how will you ever manage to wait? My, oh my. Yo, are finger, are finger maiden, are they endless? Uh, should I say that? Mm, should I say this? Oh, it's just dialogue. Heavens forbid. That is not the domain of mere men. The burning of the Erd Tree is the first cardinal sin. And you say you seek the power of the Rune of Death too? The Rune of Death goes by two names. The other is Destined Death. The forbidden shadow plucked from the Golden Order upon its creation. Uh, unleashing the rune now would be unthinkable. The fingers would never permit it. Nor would the greater will. Mm. But here we are. The fingers dormant, severing our link to the greater will. The realm and all life in ruins. Impossible events transpire beyond the ken of the fingers. When she said the fingers lie Who dormant. to say that the cardinal sin must be cardinal forever. Go on. Finish the job. Whoa, lady. Take the course you uh, deem most worthy. Isn't that like crazy heretical? No? Did this girl just like flip? flip sides but wait here's something that's confusing me many people say that the greater will isn't talking to them the two fingers have been stilled etc etc but doesn't this lady look up at those earlier in the game and be like the fingers speak and like start saying a bunch of stuff i remember at the time joking that she was just making up what the fingers were saying but like she just said they've been dormant. How long have they been dormant? Did something happen in the game and they became dormant? Because now they're definitely pointing straight up and not moving. Okay, so, so, so an event happened in the game and they stopped moving and became dormant. Okay. Cool. All right, great, great, great. We're on the same page. So what what was was the uh, was killing was killing the capital the guy at the top of the capital was that what did it or was it Radon? Because I don't know if we talked to her since Radon. We killed Morgot at the top of Landell, and then went to try the, to use the Erd Tree. And when we tried to use the Erd Tree, 
that's when it happened, right? That's when the two fingers went silent, when we were spurned by the Erd tree. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. <sighs> Out of burnt thorns. You must find kindling. Only the smoldering flame in the great forge of the giants on the highest peak in the lands between can burn the earth tree. But special kindling is required to reignite the flame. For the flame to burn the earth tree, a sacrifice is needed of one who envisions the flame and can lead you to the rune of death. Okay, thanks about for Ninja. So apparently there is a gargoyle sword that is in Necron that we can get that I can enchant. But chat earlier was telling me that they think this is actually better. Um, because apparently the effect on this is really good. Lifts the sword high up to release the power of corpse wax and launch it forward as a blade-like projectile. Does that cause bleeding or something? Um... Am I going frenzy flame ending? No. The thing, the thing, I'm sorry. The thing that I'm trying to decide now is, do I want to update this sword? Like, I'm wondering if I want to update this sword and go like crazy power stance kind of thing. DLC yet? No, not until the end of this month. Towards the end of this month. Yeah. Well, I took you no matter. Lay out your arms then. Oh, this weapon is, isn't faith based? A D faith. Hmm. Let's go to Necron. We'll 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 play around a little bit. See how it feels. Isn't Necron like red? Oh, the the red thing disappeared. Yeah. Do ye have De Faith Co? I do not have De Faith. I am sorry. I do not have De Faith. One thing, I have not finished exploring this, like at all. Should I do this before Necron? Oh, I forgot fee in her room. Thank you. Hold on. Oh my god, that looks so good. I want that. That's quick casting too. I like that. If that actually causes bleeding damage. That could be great against Moog. Oh! This weapon has D scaling on Faith at plus 10? What are, what are the total scalings for this at 10? Is Strength the only thing that goes up? It stays D. None of the scaling changes at plus 10? Really? Scaling is bad because the base damage is insane? I mean... Yeah it, yeah, it probably would be insane. Actually, if it's already 220. Yeah, when we take it to plus 10, it'll be a lot. So, here's the thing. What this has done... This weapon has um, awoken something in me. And that is the fact that that last fight we did, I didn't really use a shield. So I kind of want a, a power stance option. And I want a power stance option that's faith and with the blasphemous blade. So if I want this to do just unbelievably stupid amounts of damage, what would I use with the blasphemous blade and my stat spread, which is primarily faith? 